Okay, this is going to be a short video on how to get your uh, videos and pictures off of your AGM Rattler scope. If you notice, uh, you heard my computer connect just then. See that USB drive? There's a problem with this drive. Scan the drive. Don't pay that no of mine. That's, that's normal. Okay. You might also get a screen that pops up to import. There, that this one's coming up. This is Windows 10, and you get this <coughs> screen here. Don't worry about that. Cancel out of it. Exit out of it. Go down here, right-click on File Explorer. <coughs> Now you're going to have to figure out where your scope is. <coughs> this scope is going to be on drive I. Now it can be F, H, I, lots of different places. But if you double click on it, you're going to see that DCIM right there. And when you see that DCIM, you double click that. Now, you know you're in the right spot if it has 100 EZ VIZ. Okay, you're in the right spot. Double click on that. Then you got all these files right here. Okay, these are going to be your picture files and your video files. Now what you're going to do, you look over here if it says uh, MP4 video, MP4 video, MP4 video. Those are all the videos. I made three real short ones. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to hold down control. I'm going to click there. Hold down control. I'm going to click there and there. Now that gives me three video files. I'm going to hit Control. Well, let, let's hit uh, Control X. We want to cut them off of there. Okay. I'm going to take them over here. You can Control C to copy them or Control X to remove them. And I'm going to go over here. unposted videos and I'm control V to paste and if they're long files it'll take a little bit now what you can do is go back over to your scope file explorer And I remember that was on drive I. Go into the DCIM. You know you're in the right place. 100 EZ VIZ. Click there. Now, you can select all of these and delete them. These are just support files. And when you go to record a new uh, video, it'll automatically create those. So, once you've done that and you've transferred them over, then these files will automatically open up using Windows Media if you've got that selected as your default. This is going to be a picture of uh, just a little video of my dog right up close. You notice how it plays. She's real close. This is going to be the same thing. Three videos here. And that's Windows Media. Isn't she beautiful? <laughs> All right. Another little trick 
that most people won't tell you if you right click on that file then go down here to properties and you look here opens with where it says Windows Media you can change that uh, to any of the video uh, programs you got in there I would suggest leaving it on Windows Media or if it's not on that change it to Windows Media then you hit apply OK and then they will automatically open up in Windows Media so that's just a quick way to get your files your videos and they work on pictures too uh, off of the computer and uh, of your Rattler all you got to do is uh, turn it off now turn your scope off and everything will be fine thanks for watching